Right, 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 right. In this video, I'm going to explain the difference between a primary key and uh, an index, a database uh, uh, index. Uh, and we have will have a, a small explanation on our teams table that we created before. Now, for a primary key, uh, if you notice here, I'm, I'm using describe teams table, and if you notice that team ID is actually a primary key yes now a primary key is only a logical object yes it's, it's something that is used to define uh, to uniquely specify or, 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 or detect or specify or define records or rows so when I use a primary key that means every single row has its own primary key yes it's very unique in terms of every single row and remember also that you can actually have a combination of columns to make up a, a, a primary key so a primary key is only a logical object it simply defines a set of properties on one column or a set of columns as we said before one or more columns to require that the columns which make up the primary key are unique and that none of them are null so they shouldn't be null and they are unique so for every row uh, the primary key is always unique because they are unique and not null these values uh, or, or you know if or just single value of we of our primary key is uh, is a single column can then be used to identify a single row in the table every time so every primary key defines or identifies a single row in a table every time yes also you know in most if not all database platforms the primary key will have an index created on it now, now so primary key is only logical it's very unique it can be a combination of one or more columns and it is used to identify a single row at a time so every single row in a table has its own uh, 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 primary key unique primary key on the other hand an index does not define uniqueness an index is used to more quickly find rows in, in a table based on the values which are part of the index so an index is used to look up data quickly find data and data here can be one or more rows now remember primary key is one row but for, for indexes it can be one or more rows in a table uh, which are part of course of you know based on the values which are part of the index and remember that when we create an index within, within a database then we are creating a physical object remember here we said it's only a logical object primary key here we are creating a physical object which will be saved to our disk so the, uh, pri uh, uh, I'm sorry I, an index is a physical object but the beauty of using indexes is that it speeds up data lookup so the select statement becomes much faster although when we design uh, when we design uh, or, or decide what to use for indexes we need to check which columns are mostly used to make queries so we can actually use them as indexes so we can speed up the results of our queries now for example for our uh, teams table here let's say we want to design uh, we want to give it a, an index and let's say you know let's check what is the mostly used the most commonly used column to make queries on our teams table well let's say for example it's an establishment date let's say most users actually always uh, inquire about the establishment date of teams and and you know uh, issue queries uh, checking or asking for teams which were created between certain dates well uh, that's good enough we can use the establishment date and create an index as we will see in, in, in the upcoming video we can create uh, an index on the establishment date and remember that will actually create a physical object that will be saved to our disk but that will speed things up and whenever someone issues a query now on using that field or using that column the establishment date instead of uh, our database engine loading the whole table in memory and then looking up the data that's required or that's specified in the conditions of that statement what the database engine will do is it will only load the uh, the index object that we created remember we said this a physical object yes so it will only load that object in memory and that will speed 
things up. Of course, there's a drawback here, and the drawback is uh, that the update statement becomes uh, 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 slower. Why? It's in fact not only up not, not only update but also insert statement. Insert and update become slower. Why? It's because whenever we whenever we update the table, update the establishment, then, then we need to update the index as well. Or whenever we insert something new to the table, then we need to update the index. So we're doing more than one process. But the good thing is that the select statement is much much faster. Thanks for watching. Uh, see you next time.